Hey guys, this is Troy from the do-it-yourself world. Got a package in the mail. Something I've been anxiously waiting for. Not too long this time. It actually came pretty quick. Surprisingly quick this time. Yeah. Shredded box for padding. This is a box from Battery Hookup. Um, there should be four 18650s in here. They're at 8.4 volts, 4400 milliamp hours. And let me pull this box aside a little and lay these down here. I have purchased a mess of these batteries for working on my off-grid solar powered projects and there are a bunch of them Actually, these are um, relatively low to uncycled batteries that I bought cheap because of that fact these are the Aris modem batteries somewhere it says that at 8.4 volts 4400 milliamp hours and they have four there's Aris they have four batteries inside well, these are the robot batteries, Neato. These are exciting because they are 14.4 volts, 4200 milliamp hours, 61 watt hour. That right there is a complete battery for off-grid use. I mean, there you go, 14.4 volts. So I bought a bunch of these. So I'm gonna push the modem batteries aside a minute. So we got room, because I got these are also back in stock. These were out of stock. I bought the last of them. But they're back in stock. I'm probably going to buy more. I got a mess of these. Look, 14.4 volts. They're nothing you have to do. They've got their protective circuit inside. There's nothing you need to do if these are... Um, most of these are going to be absolutely good and usable as is. And you just plug it in. Hook them up together. You've got yourself a mess of battery packs. I could put some of these in my e-bike. How cool is that? So all of this I got for an incredibly low price. And if you use the code DIYTube, you get a 5% discount on your order. I'll put that uh, down below along with the link to battery hookup. Just out of curiosity, I want to rip one of these open. This one's got a little bit of a, a tear. So I want to rip this open and see what is inside. I have no plan on dismantling it. Any of the ones that are completely good, I don't plan on dismantling. By the way, battery hookup, while I'm working on this, has sometimes they've got new batteries, sometimes they've got discounted batteries, and sometimes they've got um like new batteries they sometimes they've got like this there i wondered so this is an interesting setup there's a housing here and a circuit board is in here so it looked like three six nine but it's not it's eight batteries seven eight with a circuit. I'm not going to dismantle this any farther than this because it's a perfect little unit. If all the cells are good and working, I've got myself a plug and play off grid battery for solar power, for e bikes, for whatever. Right here, I'm waking up a couple of these. Um, that's a term that they use. The uh, battery voltage on this. The, the cells were pretty low. This one was even lower. So what I do, I start out, oh, I've got to change, I've got to raise the, uh, the voltage. Forgive the barking, there's a rabbit outside. I try to keep it on under 200 milliamps, 100 milliamps or so when I'm starting out and very, very gentle charge these things. 
As they start to, to come up in voltage, I go up to 200, 250 milliamps, but I don't go any higher than that. I keep them on a gentle charge for the first time ever. They've been in storage, they've been sitting around, and uh, so you start out nice and gentle. This one here, see, in the beginning, you got to keep monitoring that. It's awkward because my hand. Crank up the voltage a little, and watch the current's going to start dropping and dropping and dropping. And then it comes up to a certain point, like this one did, it'll level off and then it'll just suck up current for hours until it's fully charged. Well, this is how I soft charge my batteries after they've been sitting a while. It's pretty much a lot of hands-on work, but uh, it's safer that way. I've never had any issues with thousands of batteries I've done so far. Literally thousands of batteries. I've never had any issues. I've had incredibly a surprising success with um, old batteries. But anyway, these battery hookup, they have new batteries, they've got used batteries, they've got slightly used batteries, and uh, I am it's my only place I go to now for buying batteries for do-it-yourself. So you should check it out. Anybody that's looking into getting into off-grid living, solar power, craft, or hobby, a lot of... Uh, RC batteries. A lot of these packs are the same as used in the RC packs. So you'll be surprised sometimes what you find on there. Um, those people who love the 18650s will love that site. Uh, people that love the LifePo 4s, you should absolutely check it out too. They got a lot of them on there. Different size, like uh, car size battery banks and um oh electric vehicle battery packs motor scooter battery packs they're loaded they have a lot of stuff see in the beginning this takes a lot of hands-on work well, anyway i'm going to work with these for a while and uh we'll come back after i get a couple topped off and see how they perform now this is what you get inside these modem packs you cracked it open and you've got four 18650s, which is great for recovery and building your own circuits. What I like about this is they are they are rated at uh, 8.4 volts, 4400 milliamp hours. These are 14.4 volts, 4400 milliamp, 4200 milliamp hours, almost the same. So. Two of these packs will give you the same power as one of these, so I just got to hook these together. They're very easy. I'm not even going to tear these apart. I'm just going to tie in. They've already got the uh, centered half wire for your balancing circuit, so there's no point in tearing this apart. You cut off that. You got some gold recovery in there. Really nice gold on this one. There's some beautiful gold. I get more gold here than I get in panning and prospecting. I don't know if that shows up very well. There's some beautiful gold in there. Anyway, for people into recovery, there's some really nice gold in these circuits. And uh, can I show that? There it is. That's some beautiful gold in that one right there. So um, for people into do-it-yourself 18650 battery packs, very good. These I'm going to use as is. Very good. And uh, again, they've got brand new batteries as well so if you don't want to mess with building your own they've got pretty much everything you could ever imagine but at discounted prices so check it out guys battery hookup use the code DIY tube for a discount and I'll put the links down below let me show you what I got going on upstairs and we'll end this video as I've shown before I've got two packs charging and now I have a capacity tester running on a third pack at the same time so I'm going to be cycling these through two or three cycles and these packs are going to come up to like new capacity and I'll put them into my solar power systems. So there you go guys. Really, really awesome deals on lithium ion batteries. Please like this video. Subscribe if you haven't because you never know what's coming to the homestead tomorrow. And check out Battery Hookup. Use code DIYTube. See the links in the comments in the description below.